Hi everyone, Scott here with another video at the request of one of my readers this time uh, who wanted to uh, see how to perform transcription in Dragon uh, using whatever file you have produced from a smartphone or from a voice recorder uh, how exactly to pull that file into the program and have it turn your audio into text um, it's very simple but it's one of those things that obviously you've got to know how to do before you can do it. So I'm going to show you how to do it uh, in both Dragon for Mac and Dragon, Dragon Naturally Speaking for Windows. Now, it's quite different how you do it in both. Um, but here is a file that we're going to use for both versions of Dragon. We're going to use exactly the same file. And uh, it's just a little test file I've, I've knocked together and I've dumped it onto my Mac desktop there. So the first thing you need to do in Dragon for Mac is switch from dictation mode to transcription mode. And then you'll see that this interface changes. It shows you which audio sources you've already set up for transcription. I've set up two, one for my iPhone and one for a little Sony recorder I have. So you select whichever one you made the recording with. And you can see actually here, if you click this button, manage profiles and audio sources, it shows you everything you have set up on your system. Um, so you need to make sure you've actually done this. You need to have created a transcription source down here by pressing this plus sign. And you'll go through a little bit of training. You, you'll produce a file that uh, you can initially correct. And then once that's set up, you can bring in any other files as you wish. So I've already done that. And uh, I'm going to just drag and drop. Now, if you can use the Browse Files button if the file isn't on your desktop, um, but mine is, so I'm just going to drag and drop it. And there you go. And you'll see it says transcription is in progress. You know, it's a little progress bar appears up here. And the rest just happens just like magic. And what'll, what'll happen is it'll pull um, the text that it recognizes from the audio and then spit it out into uh, a, a word or a rich text uh, document. Uh, I've set, you can change that up in, in the settings. I've set mine as a rich text file and then you can just copy and paste it into whatever you want to copy and paste it into, Scrivener, Word, whatever. And there you go, there it is. So it's uh, just opened it up on text edit. Okay, so that's Dragon for Mac, that's how you do it. And then you can just switch back to dictation mode when you are done. So I'm gonna exit that, we're finished uh, with Dragon for Mac. There we go, no, now I'm gonna show you how to do it on Dragon Naturally Speaking. So here we are in Windows 10, and here's Dragon Naturally Speaking Premium, this, this is version 13, the latest one uh, currently running. Now, the first thing you need to do, I haven't done it on here, so bear with me. Um, I just wanted to quickly show you how uh, to do this, but you will need to change your dictation source. So you go to Manage Dictation Sources under Profile. And you see on here, I, I just have my Yeti uh, microphone set up. So you would have uh, already set up your transcription source in here. You would just select that and then click the Select button. If you haven't done that, just click Add New Dictation Source and it'll give you the, the option to do it. There you go. Uh, digital Audio Recorder, Handheld or Smartphone with recording applications. You would choose one of those and then um, create a training file. When you've done that, you then go to the Tools menu up in the Dragon Bar and go to Transcribe Recording. And I just leave these two top options as is normally. And then you just browse to locate the file. And it'll be on my desktop. It's the same file, exactly the same file. I, I would, my desktop's just being duplicated here from my Mac to there it is. Click open and press transcribe. Now it's not going to give very good results because obviously I didn't have a, an actual uh, recorder profile uh, set up, but you get the idea. The, the slight difference here is it uh, does it in real time. 
So it actually uh, does the transcription before your very eyes and it just appears in DragonPad, which is a little text editor that is obviously built in uh, to Dragon Naturally Speaking. Um, and that's it. So two slightly different processes, but the end results are, are basically the same. Um, uh, I hope this has been helpful and I'll see you in another video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.